Out of every player ever played against, he was the most feared because he brought everything to the table. He was six foot eight. He was 300 pounds. He was quick. He was strong. He was fast. He was dominating. And if you were not prepared to deal with that, it would be a long, long Sunday afternoon. People uh, were aware that there were a lot of good football players coming out of schools like Grambling, but no one had taken a small college player as the top player in the draft. No one had ever uh, achieved that before. And all the eyes were on him the next year to see what kind of ability he had, what kind of football player he would be. He came up big. He came up big for everybody that ever played at a small African-American college. Buck Buchanan uh, really kind of revolutionized the play of defensive tackles in, the, in the professional football. In the early days, the tackles were the run stoppers and the ends were the pass rushers. Well, Buck was 6'7 and weighed 300 pounds. He had a wingspan of about 747. As a result, offensive linemen had a terrible time trying to, to block him. The story goes that Al Davis drafted Gene Upsaw just so we could find somebody to block Buck Buchanan because we could never block him. I remember Gene coming back in a huddle, you know, always saying, you know, don't say nothing about Buck out there. He says, because I won't be able to control him. Don't ruffle his feathers. The first game I played in for the Raiders was against Buck Buchanan. And he killed me. I mean, I don't know how I ever survived. I mean, he just, he just ate me up.